This short animation might be exaggerated, but this can be true for some deaf people. According to the 2011 American Community Survey, about 3.6% of the U.S. population consider themselves deaf or have serious difficulty hearing. This is a design brief for the deaf community by Minju Jo at the Auburn University. Sound texture particularly focused on the people who experience difficulty in their daily life due to their hearing loss. Our mission is to lower the dangers in the daily life of deaf people and provide a useful tool for everyday living. Just like the animation character William did not hear a car is coming to him or somebody knocking his door, auditory information cannot be reached to the deaf people. These can be put them in an uncomfortable situation or even in dangers. We aim to provide easy life to deaf people as we usually do. Our target users are unable or having trouble with hearing sound. They rely on visual clues and tactile information such as vibration, so it is important to make it clear to transfer auditory information to visual or tactile forms. Our first future iteration is to transfer the sound to text. We are going to use a technology that perceives environmental sounds and present it in the text. If there are any alert sounds, something crushed, falling, or hum applying sounds, our product transfer this sound to text and the users will notice what's going on. Just like the example image, the user will get any visual information. There are some products that designed and invented for the deaf people, like a doorbell that connected with the lamp so that the user noticed someone is out there from the lights on. But it is hard to set in every product in every situation. Our product simply transfer all the sound surrounded to the text that the user feel comfortable to use and able to adopt in every situation. This is how we help deaf people.